Find the derivative of a polynomial times a trig function with an x squared in it. All right, so this is going to involve a combination of product rule. And then when I take the derivative of this guy, I'm going to use chain rule. So remember, product rule is u prime v plus v prime u. So let's set that all up. So this is regular u. This is regular v. I already said that. <laughs> so it's right there. u prime is going to be, drop down the 5, 10, x to the 4th, uh, plus nothing. v prime is going to involve chain rule. The chain rule is take the derivative of the outside stuff, keep the inside stuff, but then multiply everything by the derivative of the inside stuff. So V prime is going to be the derivative of the outside. So the derivative of cosine, which is negative sine, keep the inside x squared, but multiply everything by the derivative of the inside. And the derivative of x squared is 2x. So cleaning this up, I get negative, negative 2x sine x squared. So let's put this all together. y prime is u prime, which I called 10x to the fourth, v, which is cos x squared, plus v prime, which was negative, so let's put that plus into a negative, minus 2x sine x squared times u, which was 2x to the fifth plus 3. Uh, you know, I know I could distribute that. Make that negative 4x to the 6, negative 6x, and then, uh, you know, attach sine to it. But that really won't get me anywhere. Nothing's going to cancel out if I do that. I don't think it will. Nope. So I'm going to leave it like that. It looks kind of sloppy, but it's acceptable. So that's that. That's a uh, power rule or product rule and power rule and chain rule. So many rules. Where are we? School? <laughs> Just kidding. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.